Well, come on, let's be honest. I'm a simpleton. You, you're the son of a senator. Me, I know nothing. Like, if I could, I would write in Tony Stark, Iron Man, for president. I just found out recently, fictional characters cannot be president. So, in the meantime, there's a movie that celebrates what? Your right to vote. It's all about voting. It's nonpartisan. I sat down with Stacey Abrams to talk about it. Uh, first of all, things you should know about Stacey Abrams. She was the very first African-American woman gubernatorial nominee in the history of America. Things you should know about this movie. It's directed by Liz Garbus. You don't know that name, but she's the lady behind the most popular Golden State Killer documentary out there. Uh, I talked to Stacey about how exhausting it was to put this movie together. Take a listen. I... I was privileged to have partners in this process. Liz Garbus and Lisa Cortez did an ex extraordinary job with this film. I see sometimes over 200 films a year. So like, I like everything. My friends, it's like pulling teeth to get them to a documentary. Tell everyone why people who have never stepped foot in a documentary or clicked on a documentary should do so if they can with this. Because this is a story that actually tells us about who we are and it's not just about one person. It covers the gamut. It's not political in the sense that it's not partisan. It's about who we are as an Amer as a as a nation, who we are as Americans, and it's actually really interesting to learn this stuff. I watched this movie. I wrote a book about it, and I learned something not in the drudgery way that people might think about it, but in this sort of aha moment that tells me that I have a power I didn't really fully understand. Think about it as a superhero movie for dem for you know, for democracy. Are you blown away at how skillful it is, nonpartisan? We just want people to get out there and vote and have their vote count. And I think that's the biggest piece of this. I, yes, I'm a Democrat, but my job is to make sure that Republicans and independents can all cast their ballots because a democracy doesn't work if we artificially choose who can be heard. It's not a democracy then, it's an autocracy. And so my responsibility, if I truly am a patriot, is to ensure that people with whom I vehemently disagree, that they get to be heard as well. And if we do that work, and if we do it well, we'll get the country we deserve. And the movie, by the way, premieres tonight uh, in capital cities. Hey, wait a minute, we're a capital city. Would you like to see it at the West Wind hey. Drive-In? You can, it's highly educational. Take the kids, grab hey. your own popcorn and head out there. Go to my Facebook page, Marcus Allen Show, I'll help you out. Uh, yes, question listen. in the front row. Yes, no, you? listen, I, I thought you, obviously she's a Democrat. I thought that was straight down the middle and I'm always looking for that, you know. And so I thought that that was uh, you 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 did a good job, and you said you're not political like that, but I thought you yeah were. yeah way to go absolutely it was very important for me to do that Walt and uh, I wouldn't be talking about this movie if it wasn't nonpartisan right. I like the movie just want everybody to get out there and vote and my boss reminded me yesterday make sure you shoot down the middle I always do yes she did <laughs> all right thank you Mark.